The Big E Fairgrounds is packed with hundreds of people this weekend. 22 News reporter Eugene Cho is live in West Springfield to explain what's drawing so many people to the Eastern States Exposition. We're at Better Living Center here at the Big E Fairgrounds, and when the door opens soon at 10 o'clock to the public, thousands of people will be here for Amherst Railway Society's Railroad Hobby Show. And joining me live right now is Jim Conway. He is one of the manufacturers of the model trains that are here today, and he traveled all the way from Tucson, Arizona to be here. Thank you so much for joining well, us. Thank you, and good morning. Thank you. And your model trains are actually modeled after some real-life trains that ran here in New England. Tell us about a couple of those. Yes, well, we have made trains from all eras and all scales, but what we're featuring here today is one that was a model of the New Haven Comet that was built in 1935 and was the original streamlined train in the Northeast, ran between Providence and Boston for many, many years until it was scrapped in 1951. And you were telling me earlier that really you're expecting thousands of people to be here today. What about this event draws so many people? Well, trains have been a fascinating hobby for many people for many years. Uh, just about everyone that's over maybe 50 years old remembers getting a Lionel train as a small child. Uh, that tradition continues today with Thomas the Tank Engine, and you can see a lot of that type of item on display here, as well as the HO and N scale trains we manufacture up through Lionel trains. And you can even find trains here, as your cameraman asked me about, that are live steam that could run in your backyard. So there's something here for the entire family to come out and see. So both for parents and children, something right. fun for them to do. Yes, Thank you so right. much, You're Jim. Welcome. So the door opens to the public at 10 o'clock. That's just about an hour from now. The admission is $15. And for children, if they are with parents, they can get in for free. Live in West Springfield, Eugene Cho, 22 News.